Hey, what's going on guys? BMS122223 here with another tutorial on how to get your dev files. You know, a lot of times you want to back up your, your files through package uh, backup through the iPhone or you do it through the iTunes and uh, just basically takes a lot of space up on your phone. So uh, what I've got plan on doing today is to show you how to get your dev files. That way you can always have them stored on your um, in a folder on your computer and then you'll always have them so that way if anything happens with your phone you'll be able to uh, go ahead and install these dev files back onto your phone, get your applications back, and also in case uh, you know the version that you upgrade to, you don't like it or it's not working properly, so you can go back to the old version. So um, this is going to be able to show you how to get your dev files. So first thing you want to do, I'm on Mac. You can go ahead and get Cyberduck, or you can also go ahead and uh, do WinSCP or something like that on Windows. So go ahead and sign in, and then you want to go up one time. Go to Cache. APT Archives. And then you'll see a folder and then it'll say partial. Click on it, and there's nothing in there. So go ahead and close that out. And to get your dev file, all you have to do is go into Cydia. Now you can do this for a new theme or application that you just downloaded, or you can actually do it through your, your files that you have on your phone right now. Um, so basically, usually when you have your files on your phone, there's certain applications that you like to have all the time. So that's what I'm basically going to show you how to do now. So go to Manage, Packages, and then go ahead and select, um, just for demonstration purposes, I'm going to select AFC2ADD. Go ahead and select it. You can go ahead and modify it and reinstall it. Confirm. It's a pretty small file, so that's why I chose it. It's not going to take that long to do. So once it respring's or comes out of the uh, the magic mode here, reloading data, it's going to show you uh, either return to Cydia or respring. Um, once that happens, leave it alone. We're not going to do anything yet with it, and then we're going to go in. I'm going to show you how to get your dev file. So right now, I'm not touching Cydia, as you can see. Go back into Cyberduck. Go ahead and sign in here. And go up one more time. Cache. APT. Archives. And there you go, guys. As you can see right here, you have your, your dev file. So go ahead, drag it onto the desktop, drag it into a folder. Uh, it'll ask you if you want to accept it, allow it. Go ahead and do so. And this is a cool way, easy way, how to get your dev files. Hope this helped you out. Uh, any other future support, go ahead and check out my site, which is www.siphoneme.wordpress.com. See you there, guys. Take care.